One of the many great features of FlexScreen is that it can be easily rescreened at home using just a few simple tools. First, you'll need some fiberglass mesh material. This can be purchased from Amazon or any big box hardware store. We recommend the AdForce brand. Next, you'll need a mini heat press. This can also be purchased from Amazon. There are various brands that range from about $18 to $30. We found that this brand works well for the process. You'll also need a utility knife and possibly a pair of scissors. Now let's get started. First, note the two sides of flex screen. One side has the screen mesh attached to it and the other side doesn't. We recommend leaving the original screen mesh on the frame as it will help keep the frame square during the rescreening process. You'll remove the original damaged mesh at the end. To begin, place the screen on a table with the damaged mesh side down. Lay your new piece of screen mesh over the screen frame, leaving about 2 inches of extra cloth around the edges. If your mini heat press has multiple settings, be sure to choose the highest setting. Once the heat press is at full temperature, press it firmly on one corner of the flex screen, securing the mesh to the frame. Then pull the screen mesh towards you tightly and make sure it is aligned with the frame. Slowly move the heat press down the frame, keeping the mesh material taut as you go. Here it is important to maintain consistent speed and pressure. Then repeat this process on all sides of the frame. When the mesh is fully attached, use a utility knife to carefully trim away the excess. Finish the project by turning the screen over and removing the original damaged mesh from the other side by simply pulling it away from the frame. If cutting is required to remove the damaged mesh, just be careful to stay clear of the new mesh on the other side. And now your flex screen is as good as new.